Hey guys, um, tell I'm fresh in the shower, and I figured out this would be the best time to talk about my skincare routine since I just finished doing it. Okay, I'm gonna start off with my skin type. I have um, oily skin. I have acne-prone skin. Um, I have huge pores here and here. A lot of scarring, and yeah, like I have oily skin. It's not a combination, but it's oily. Um, yeah. So um, I'm gonna provide you a list of all of the facial washes I've tried in my lifetime and all of these either worked and then stopped working or just did not work at all so I'm going to flash it right now of all of those I have two of them on hand um I used this is the Celtec this was like a savior to me when I was like, doing my worst breakout moment like when I, that was my senior year and I had the worst acne ever it was like huge you know like the scarring is still there like that's how bad it is it was I mean and um yeah but then when, it, when my face cleared up I stopped using that because even if, even though like it like cleared up my acne and my pimples and stuff like that um the blackheads like here my nose here were like proliferating like crazy because it has natural moisturizing factor and that just that's like blackhead fertilizer you know so I stopped then um, the second one that I have on hand is the clean and clear I stopped using this even though I finished it I just finished because it, it was a waste but I stopped using it because it just didn't really do anything for me you know like nothing really happened like, nothing changed like no nothing like so what I use right now is this plain soap. Um, this is it's an antibacterial. Um, let me wash my hands. Um, antibacterial soap, and I also have um, body acne, like acne on my body. And um, if that helps control or like minimize the acne, like you know pimples on my body, then it should be able to do that on my face, which it does. So it's fine. So people say you should use soap on your face, but you know, whatever works for you, works for you. Okay, so next is exfoliation. Um, I exfoliate with St. Ives Apricot Scrub. This is for blemish and black head control. This is for acne and oily, oily and acne prone skin. It's oil free and has 2% salicylic acid. This is what I use on both my body and my face. Um, I exfoliate my face about 2-3 to three times a week sometimes more depending on if my face feels like this no like not really good it just needs like the extra exfoliation I exfoliate more than that but most of the time it's two to three times a week sometimes I admit I don't exfoliate at all so yeah but on average two to three times a week um then on my body I exfoliate whenever I feel like it <laughs> right because I'm lazy like that Okay, um, then after I do that, so the first step is washing, exfoliating. Next is um, toning. I use a toner. This is a Eskimal. This is in the Philippines. I don't know if you guys had this in the States. I doubt it. This is um, Eskinol Skin Therapy Oxygen Skin Renew Facial Toner. It's, it has sea minerals for younger looking skin. It doesn't do that. Um, but yeah, <laughs> it's supposed to, uh, you know, like make your skin not dull and you know make it look younger and healthy and you know whatever whatever it just cleans my face it's fine it you know toner it just cleans my face removes whatever dirt that the soap did not remove and does it fine wonderful okay so wash exfoliate tone moisturize I use this Myra E moisturizer. I use this all the time makeup for my makeup, primer, moisturizer before I go to bed when I wake up. This is just my all around moisturizer. Um, I should. Um, I'm looking for a um a moisturizer like a night for at for night. So that way I can deep moisturize my skin because at night sometimes it's just really really dry. But I can't find one that's um good like this. The Olay Total Effects totally breaks me up so it's a good thing that was a tester or else I would like totally cry okay so last and most important step of my skin regimen is my acne 
gel. This is Panoxyl and it's benzoyl peroxide and it's for severe acne and body acne. This is the 10% because it has a 5%. This is the 10%. This is for severe. And this is like my holy grail of facial products. Without this, my face would be full of pimples. And I started using that during my senior year when I, like I said, I had like the worst breakup ever. So, yeah. That's my skin regimen. And, um, yeah. Basically, my skin looks wonderful when I have foundation because my foundation is godsend. But yeah, so um, I hope you're happy with what I did, my video, and hope you learned something, sort of. And yeah, so thanks for watching, and bye-bye. Good night. I'm going to bed now. Bye.